I'm back in the Alucab workshop near Cape Town and surrounded by, well, yes, Land Cruiser Troopies. There are five of them in the late stages of construction and interestingly enough all five, and there are two outside, are as a result of my vehicle, the television show and the YouTube channel videos. No other advertising at all. Uh, a bit of Facebook here and there but nothing else. And here they are and the, and the wonderful thing is as I, as I walk around and I see on the outside the vehicles look very very similar I mean the configuration is really the same but when I go inside that's when things start getting interesting because each individual client has expressed their creativity themselves and no I wouldn't do it like that but that's I'm not them so it's fantastic I love it I love seeing people's creativity in this and what they do with their vehicles. But of all the vehicles in the workshop, this to me is the most interesting because it's, it's the most like mine. Many of them have similar components to mine, but this one is a dead ringer. I start with, well, let's have a look here. The Heller HID spot lamps. And a TJM bull bar and plasma winch. Safari snorkel. The suspension is the same. There, got BF Goodrich all-terrain tires. Good choice. Max tracks. Even the heater in the back is the same. Although again, the configuration is very different. Oh, look, same rear wheel carrier as well. Hmm. So those of you who so kindly donated so much equipment for the prototype vehicle I thank you very much but it's the result is sales in your hands now it's another one now of course the Troopy is an ideal candidate for this but here's another vehicle that is as well of course this is the obvious choice isn't it the Land Rover 110 station wagon it occurs to me on looking at it that there might be a problem Having owned a Defender, I know how important it is for Defender owners to keep their vehicles looking fantastic because it is such a fantastic looking vehicle. But imagine taking away that lovely slanted roof and those windows. You know, this roof is not particularly attractive. On the Troopy, you don't really notice it, but in a Land Rover, you would. Happily, that's not a problem because what they've done is they've used the Land Rover's own lovely roof, complete with windows and all. Well, this is not configured like my vehicle, so it's not, ex it's not quite possible for me to do a, an exact comparison, but my immediate reaction is it's the same. Again, like the, the Troopy, uh, the, the interior, all of these Troopies they're building now, the interiors are all so, so different. Likewise with this, I probably wouldn't do this, but then again, I might do. Because this rather large box here is um, accessible from the outside. Um, if I think about the seating arrangement that I might put in like mine, it would be the same. The width looks, it feels a little narrower, but uh, there's not much in it. I, I think it will work. There's no reason why this won't work. No reason at all. In fact, the finish is a bit better. 